So this has been a great forum to bring together not only entrepreneurs, but angel investors. The investment community locally is very fragmented, and so this is one of the few chances to actually meet individuals that are actively investing and that are local investors. Everyone knows about all the big funds, and everyone knows about the international donors and uh, others that are in this space, but very few people actually know who are the angels that are uh, contributing to this growing marketplace. One of the best things about learning about angel investor, or learning about angel investing is getting a group of people together who are familiar with doing investments in a local market, maybe that's all over Africa or might be here in Kenya. Uh, sharing their experiences about best ways to do that and learning about new companies and new opportunities to invest in. So, especially when things are just getting started, it's great to have other people to share experience with and uh, work together on making deals. So listening to pitches again is also really interesting, lots of great different ideas and I really think that what they're doing is a great thing, just putting entrepreneurship on the map and making it a conversation. But uh, there have been a couple of solid pitches that will definitely be following up from, from the angel pitch. It's a great first look at the Eastern African market um, of startups. I think we've seen things like scale-ups and startups, and even some pre-startups, it would seem, like guys who have just really gotten started. They might not have even built the product, they sort of have this vision, but it's clear that they haven't really thought through where they're going to take it, which is fine. Um, so I think it's a really great way to spend two days in Africa um, and sort of get a litmus test of what's happening here. There's definitely a lot of introductions that I think will go somewhere. Um, and naturally, it takes a little bit of time. Um, it's great to see the first pitch. Um, and specific to what I do, I also look for strategic relationships. And I think Angel Fair is a great platform for that. For, for us, there's probably about four um, investors that we've connected with while here. We've been fortunate to also close an investment while here. Well, it's a great forum to meet, uh, obviously, investors. Uh, but it's also great in the sense that you don't only get a chance to meet local investors, you also meet with international investors, people coming from Europe uh, and, uh, and, and the States, among other, um, other continents. And they, over two days you really get a chance to sit down with them. They, they, they've essentially cleared their, their diary to sit down and talk to uh, startups and scale-ups. So yeah, that is definitely a great opportunity for, uh, for businesses, whether they are scale-ups or startups, to come and, and engage with uh, investors. From my personal experience, I think that Angel Fair Africa um, is a good initiative because it is um, a platform that provides opportunity for startup entrepreneurs or um, entrepreneurs heading into maturity to meet prospective investors, whether they be um, strategic investors or uh, people who are placing um, an investment and are expecting to find a good return. I think Angel Fair Africa is fantastic. It's allowed me to connect and reconnect with a, a lot of people who I think are very uh, important and influential in the space that we work in. I've met uh, several investors, uh, both uh, representatives of funds as well as uh, individual angels uh, who have expressed interest in helping us finish off our round of funding. I think it's fantastic. I think this should be done twice a year um, in different countries, of course, that would drive her crazy. But I think it's wonderful. I think you bring together all the right people, talking about all the right things. It's really great that your organization is involved because I think everybody should be involved, not just investors, entrepreneurs, it should be government, it should be nonprofit, World Bank. We're all in this together. 